Ordinals, a lot of fun going around, a lot of worry, a lot of doubt, uncertainty, all that shit. Um, we're going to go through back to the basics. We're going to talk about market psychology, market sentiment, and why we're actually in a value zone right now in the ordinal space. But uh, I'm going to do it one by one, starting off with a crowd favorite track. So starting things off, we're going to be talking about track T-R-A-C. Now you need to make sure that this is the ordinals track and not origin trail origin trail ain't gonna do shit track is going to do many multiples from here in my opinion currently sitting at two dollars and 89 cents uh with a market structure that uh, looks okay but we do need to hold this level so let's go over to a chart and just kind of dissect it a little bit further shout out to the vip group who is still in a 10x of profit uh, we haven't sold any track yet we're not about to sell any track even if we head down to lower levels we're not ready to sell track uh, we got a nice support here now credit where credit is due the bears do look to be in control on track partly could be the fact that there is a, a transitional token so there's going to be track the governance token but then there's also going to be the tap token so if you hold any track tokens or if you hold any pipe tokens you are going to be airdropped the new tap tokens those are coming out after the halving so maybe there's uh you know a lot of uncertainty as to which token is going to be the best one so as a result uh this one is losing some steam losing some demand but to me it's a it's a no-brainer this is a really important infrastructure play this is going to be uh contributing to making ordinal theory decentralized so i think it's a very important project and yeah it's uh, definitely got more upside in my opinion not financial advice what i would be looking for is we need to get a nice clean break kind of above this level of the of the first real impulse here we got some nice resistance here at around six dollars we had a failed rally out of the six dollar level here we had another failed rally out of the six dollar level here uh, our moving averages on our indicator are in bearish alignment and our bull market bear market indicator is red indicating that the bears are still in control one nice thing to see on this chart is we do have a bullish divergence occurring here on the rsi you can see that uh, we have higher lows on the rsi this could be invalidated but as it stands right now we have higher lows on the rsi and we have a lower low on price that is a bullish divergence so if we can turn things around and we can get back on top of this level reclaim kind of the three dollar level and begin to curl these moving averages to the upside then we would be looking a lot better go for another retest of the six dollar level break above it and then we're off to the races i i shit you not i think this could reach 300 to 500 maybe even higher in a bull market mania again not financial advice but uh, if you guys are interested do your own research do your own due diligence on this one the next one I want to talk about is SATs. So SATs is kind of a meme token. You may be familiar with the term SATs in the context of uh, Bitcoin's smallest denomination. There are 100 million SATs in every Bitcoin. It's kind of like there are 100 pennies to every dollar. Um, but yeah, this is a, a good project. I think it has good meme ability, which is always good on the fundamentals side of things. Obviously, we've seen a very meme coin driven market thus far. So obviously, there's a lot of degenerate gamblers out there. And uh, I think sats could be a nice play. Let's go ahead and take a look at the technical chart. And this is not bad. This is not a bad structure. We're kind of in this accumulation zone. Let's uh, put a parallel channel up here. This is not a bad zone, you know, as long as we can kind of hang out, let me turn alpha metrics off here. As long as we can hang out in this channel, I'm bullish. Now, those of you who are in the VIP, you are sitting on 4,628% profit. Are we taking profits yet? No, we're not because we're complete fucking degenerates that are not going to be taking profit even when you're sitting on a 46x we're here for the big swings we're here for the big wins and uh i do think that this one has decent structure i think it has decent potential and when the liquidity pools that are going to be coming on layer two bitcoin uh need to be filled up this is going to be an in-demand asset in my opinion so look out for uh some of those new apps that are going to be coming online post halving we're about 16 days away from the halving so we could see a market shift 
post having when these applications come online. The next project I want to take a look at is Bitmaps. Bitmaps is uh, probably my favorite uh, project in the entire ecosystem not really run by a company it's not really run by a founder it's not run by an individual it is a protocol layer to bitcoin this is kind of a metaverse standard for bitcoin now that's a lot of buzzwords and that you know what is the metaverse and what will who's going to build on top of the bitcoins uh on the bitmap standard there's a lot of fair uh criticisms and uh questions out there but this is one of the most interesting projects in the space for me right now and it is very liquid we are in a dead ordinals market and we still have 20 buys pending here on magic eden there's a lot of volume going through this project it's got a huge community it's got a lot of volume these are really good metrics when you're measuring the health of a project if i was to pick one of the stronger projects in the ordinal space bitmaps is definitely going to be up there when we analyze the floor price we can see that it has gotten to a high of uh, 0 0.0077 BTC. That's about 7.7 7 million sats per bitmap. Uh, currently sitting much, much lower now at around, uh, currently sitting at a much lower level at around 2 million sats, but we are slowing down. You can see the acceleration to the downside here was very volatile. A lot of uh, value was lost. We've lost a good amount. We're down 75% on bitmap. Now, 70% retracements on these really new projects in the context of a bull market. You see this kind of stuff. This is a very misunderstood project. This is something that had a lot of hype, didn't return on the gains uh, for a lot of people. And there's just been a flood of supply. There's a lot of volume going through this one. So the Bitcoin cycle is going to keep on going. You know, we're not at the end of the Bitcoin cycle here. And this is a very important project, in my opinion. So not financial advice, but I certainly think that we are in the value zone who is here for bitmaps. The last project I want to take a look at is NatCats. NatCats, this is a UNAT. This is a unique, non-arbitrary token. Um, but why this project is interesting is the block data. The Bitcoin block data is what gives these cats their attributes so it you know it's completely non-arbitrary it is the bitcoin blockchain that decides who gets a pearl necklace who gets a headband who smokes a cigarette who gets an earring and you can't predict it so you can't game the system you can't anticipate what the next cat is going to be uh, you can't front run like a valuable cat because you don't know when the next valuable cat is going to be um, not only that it's just a, a beautiful ability for the bitcoin blockchain to express some sort of creativity uh, maybe i'm getting a little too meta about this but uh anyways i think that this is a an interesting project that is currently in a good value zone if we take a look at the floor price you know we are definitely slowing down we're slowing down the uh the we're, we're hitting a floor you know not financial advice and don't quote me on this but if i was to guess based on my professional opinion I think we're at a floor. We are we are within five to ten percent of a floor here. Those are my picks. Let me know in the comments section down below if you agree. Did I miss anything? Do you think that there are much better projects that have much higher upside? Explain your thesis down below, or better yet, explain your thesis in the Discord. I want to invite you to come into the Discord. We share a ton of Ordinals Alpha. We have also been killing it on the trading side of the trading group. We have been posting entries, exits, take profits. Uh, really good last couple of trades. We've been getting some very profitable scalps while everybody else is losing money. We are making money. So we encourage you to go and check things out. Until next time, please trade safe. It is a jungle out there. Peace.